Hey guys, what's up? It's Monkle Zonkey. So, in this video, what I'm doing is some solo corp. Um, I'm actually not making a guide or anything for some reason. That's usually what I do on this channel. But uh, in this video, I just wanted to kind of mess around and experiment a bit with the Ascension crossbows. Since I have figured out that Ascension crossbows aren't necessarily the greatest for Slayer, they're okay for a couple tasks, but for most tasks, they're not very useful. Um, I'm just, I kind of using them at some different places. I'll have another video tomorrow where I used Ascension Crossbows at Fight Cauldron um, for an hour and basically saw how good they were there. But I'm just experimenting with some different uh, situations where you can use these crossbows and see uh, if there's any very good uses for them. So Solo Corp is one thing that I wanted to try just because some people in the friends chat were asking for a corp guide. I'm not going to be making a corp guide because to be completely honest I really suck at it. Um, I did five kills I recorded four of them. Um, out of those five kills, I failed one kill, and I got four kills. I did not record the first kill because the first kill was just kind of experimenting to see if Ascension Crossbows would even be a viable option at Corp at all. But I think I may have just stumbled upon the best way to kill Corp. Um, possibly. I don't know for that for a fact, because uh, I can't melee Corp solo. I'm not very good at it. Um, I tried a couple melee kills. All of them I got Corp to, like, almost dead, and then I ran out of food and had to telly, so... Out of three melee solos, melee solo attempts, I failed all of them. Um, I'm not ashamed to admit that. I'm not the best at PVM or anything like that. But um, one thing I can say that Ascension Crossbows, they actually are roughly, maybe not quite as fast as Zamoraki and Spear um, with like Torva and Overlords and everything, but pretty darn close because um, I was talking to someone who has done quite a bit of solo corp and they're like, yeah, the average uh, melee kill is about four minutes, and four minutes is what I was getting too. Um, and they were in Torva as well, and I was just in uh, Death Lotus, so I was not in DPS gear, and I still was getting about four minute kills. So I don't think that's too bad. My fastest kill was three minutes and 48 seconds, and my slowest kill was like four minutes and 22 seconds. Um, so yeah, right around four minute kills for Solo Corp. Uh, basically, the general strategy here is to get up to... Um, your maximum adrenaline as fast as possible then use death swiftness and then just own him um, and you can use death swiftness again later in the kill uh, you basically get two ultimates well three ultimates the entire kill but two ultimates like after the core comes out usually um, because I do use ring of vigor so that saves 10% adrenaline after you use an ultimate which is pretty handy here um, so for my two ultimates I use uh, Guthix's blessing and death swiftness and you just kind of have to juggle around uh, you know run around the death swiftness circle with the core chasing you which can be a little bit hairy as you can see here from this kill um, that was close that wasn't even my closest kill by the way but that one was close um, but this was my closest kill here, uh, the closest I came to failing without actually failing. So it can be a bit tricky just to run around the uh, the death swiftness circle with the core chasing you, but it is doable. Um, I messed up a few times and got hit by the core a little bit, but oh well, what can you do? Um, as you, another thing you might notice is I am using sharks, and that's because you don't need rock tails to solo corp. Well, because you're just a complete tank in Death Lotus, like his magic splashes a lot on you. Although when it does hit, it hits 1,000 to 2,000 every single time, so that's a bit frustrating. But still, um, yeah, so I, for melee solo, you do need like rock tails or possibly even rock tail soups if you aren't the greatest. Um, but for the range solo, of course you can't do this with like anything less than ascension crossbows, and I realize not, not a whole lot of people have them. But for the range solo, you can uh, just use sharks and get away with using that. So it's nice for cheap people like me. I know I have a lot of money, and I can definitely easily afford rock tails, but I just prefer using sharks. I don't know why. I think rock tails are like 3.5k, and sharks are like 2k, so saves a little bit of money. Um, but yeah, if you did this with rock tails, you'd get a kill every time, no problem. Um, with sharks, sometimes it gets a bit close, but rock tails are quite a lot more healing, so it would definitely be a lot easier with rock tails. Man, if uh, familiars were allowed in here, Solo Corp would be probably one of the easiest bosses, but yeah, you can't bring familiars in. I thought it was kind of funny how this boss was released right after summoning, and then Jagex was like, oh yeah, you can't use familiars here. We're re re releasing this new skill, but you can't use the new skill at the new boss. That was a bit weird. But anyway, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Hopefully you enjoy, and farewell.